This is RIDE, Remote Intention Detecting Emulator, a device designed for the remote control of the motorcycle arrows. RIDE is a built-in EEG acquisition device placed in the helmet. The recorded EEG trace is sent via wireless connection to the internal processor of the motorbike that helps the aim of elaborated and thereupon construe a proper order for the motorcycle electronic stuff. Ride has been taught to help forgetful riders in order to automatically insert turn signal in the excellent moment in which the riders intend to turn in the everyday journey. Virtually, this device could be used for every electronic control unit of the motorcycle. We spent the last few months working on an integrated helmet system that can read the rider's EEG waves and consequently respond. To do that, we used the Epoch, an innovative brain-computer interface of Emotive Corporation. It is completely wireless, equipped with 14 channels. Emotive Epoch is one of the most used EEG system in the research and development field because of its good value for money. Indeed, it's over mentioned in most of research papers. Phase 1. Wearing the helmet. Phase 2. Acquiring AG Ways at last. Phase 3. Acquiring EEG waves with specific visual stimuli. We focused on the percentage power of the interesting bandwidth alpha and beta. Phase 4. Compare data to matchup to set an initial approach to highlight the differences between the two types of acquisitions and calculate a threshold for the control of the arrow. Phase 5. Algorithm implementation on LabVIEW to display a real-time Instagram of the interesting bandwidth. We can see a variation in the different percentage powers of a single electrode under different visual stimuli. We had the possibility to implement a variation detector based on thresholds. Recognition of the specific visual stimulus from the bandwidth power feature. We exploited this algorithm to control motorbike arrows brake system. Result? When the subject perceived the visual stimulus, Ride detected the intention and turned on the associated LED. In fact, while Andrea sees the left arrow, the system turns on the left LED. Considering the economic point of view, you can get MOTV Clock from $399. It offers a, a so high signal quality that made it the most used device in biomedical studies. It can be applied also in the gaming field for the augmented reality or for the control of robots, RC auto or drones. This project is a natural evolution of these applications and it surely represents the natural direction towards which the motos world is going. To develop this project today would uh, bring more advantages in terms of time and so in innovation and uh, road safety. Fondazione ANIA, Italian National Association of Insurance Companies, established that uh, about 76% of road accidents are due to human factor. In particular, 46% of these accidents are due to human distraction. This number increases if we consider fatigue factor to about 
rise could help to strongly decrease these numbers. Remotely inserting the arrows avoids oversight, but there is more. When a rider perceives a danger, ride could automatically insert the hazard lights, or also modifying the engine power. Moreover, ride could read when a rider has a boat of sleepiness through perception of specific EEG bandwidth power. This could be made easier through the use of dry electrodes. This electrode could be implemented in a little integrated circuit placed in the helmet and it could be wirelessly connected with the motorcycle. The first helmet for motorbike EEG remote control. Right. Thank you. Maybe.